we had a ski club and we we're always skiing and racing and then you know i'd always sneak off and start jumping and um soon my jumps got bigger and then suddenly i was going upside down and then suddenly freestyle skiing came along i won 42 world cups and i won three consecutive aerial titles uh from 77 to 1980 and three combined titles still you know struggling with what i was going to do with my life but uh i enrolled in cinematography in a in a college in toronto uh, willie asked me to, to to ski in a bond film and i couldn't go I, I i was defending my world title it was more important to me than being james bond if you can imagine that willie got a contract to do the ski sequence in uh, four year eyes only and he said i want you to do it this time and we're heading to st moritz to practice in the bob run you're gonna ski it as james bond <laughs> suddenly i was skating as fast as i could from the top just trying to get as much speed and getting into a tuck and oh, just God. and it was just mind-blowing for me it was uh a real um, eye-opener that I could actually hold an edge on solid ice going 60 miles an hour vertical. Suddenly I was hanging out with Roger Moore and Carol Bouquet, you know, and uh, there are 250 people on the set. Jackie Chan's an incredible athlete, and the idea was to teach him quickly how to learn how to snowboard so he could do his own stuff. And he did. Uh, I taught him in 10 days, and he was jumping 10-foot cliffs. Because suddenly they would say, oh, you have to film the shot. And I wouldn't even get in my ski clothes. I'd wear my freaking wardrobe. I had to hold it downhill tuck, right? But every time I got into the downhill tuck, I would just boom, speed away from Lily Bogner on the on the on the um, who was trying to hold this heavy camera, right? As soon as I left the lift, it was 